Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. So today is another episode of our Stardew Valley Expanded series, and I guess now also Ridgeside Village. If you didn't see the last episode, we added a new mod to the series, and since then that mod has had a massive update, a 2.0 update, so there's gonna be a load more content. It took a long time for my PC to boot up Stardew this morning, so I'm a little bit overwhelmed and scared about how much content has been added. <laughs> but anyways, let's jump straight in. So we've got a rain day and a good luck day. It would be a very good day to go mining I suppose. Let's grab these coffee beans. Oh our inventory is full. <laughs> oh we've got seeds in our inventory for some reason. We should probably plant those. Do we have enough time? They take six days. Yeah we have just about enough time to plant them. We also have a rare seed to put away. I think I need to organize my chests a little bit more as well. Let's just dump everything here for now. <laughs> How long do sunflower seeds take? They take eight days but they can also go into full anyway so that's fine. I think I should start trying to think where we'd place our sprinklers. I want to have a nice sprinkler system for the autumn time so maybe we should get rid of them here and instead start seeing where we'd place them for the autumn let's just put them here for now i'll plant all the seeds around these probably still a couple of episodes until we get into fall but we may as well start planning ahead right plant all these radish seeds and then we have free sunflower seeds i'll just dump them up here and i'll grab these coffee beans and we have some tomatoes as well my chests are not organized at all <laughs> re-editing the vods from my 100 series i realized how bad i was at stardew at the beginning and also so how bad I am at organization. I'd like to think I've gotten better, but this series is making me question that, to be honest. <laughs> Put these in the Mayo Maker. So yeah, what should I do today? I think mining would be good for today in game, because we do have a good luck day and a rain day. I'd also really like to work on my tree farm for maple syrup and pine tar and such. I forgot my milk pail. Let me go grab that. For that, I'm going to need a bunch of copper for tappers and such. So it'd be good to go mining for that as well. And I also kind of want to reach deeper in the mines. I don't even know what level we're on. I'm gathering data for the correlation between soil alkalinity and crop fructose levels. Long story short, I need a fresh melon. Okay, do we have a melon? We might have some. Let's see. We actually do. Okay, good. I can put one in the jar and I can give one to Demetrius. That is super handy. We also have oranges that Bert wants, but I don't think we're going to get those very soon. Um, we need to talk to Lola today as well. And we've got all the regular ones as well. So yeah, let's go mining today. I think that sounds like a good shout. Oh, new cutscene. Who's this? Um, this is embarrassing. How long were we even gone that we don't know where to go? Hmm, let me think. Maybe we could... What is happening here? They look like they've just been married. Why are they in like a suit and dress? Why do I just stand on the edge of this all the time? Like, why do I never just go and talk to them? <laughs> yep, we're lost. Oh no. <laughs> I hope someone passes by so we can ask for directions. Hi. I'm conveniently just stood here, not at all eavesdropping. Oh, young lady, would you be a dear and help us find the way to the cable car? We seem to have lost our way. Ah, some help, thank you. Oh no, we're not Taurus. We just haven't returned for a long time. We're traveling around the world for reasons. That's really sus. Why would you say that? Why wouldn't you just finish it at we're traveling around the world? I wouldn't have questioned it then, but when you add for reasons, that makes it really sus. Ah yes, the cable car. So could you guide us there? We're really sorry to bother you. There's the cable car. Goodbye. Ah, so this is where it was. Oh, I'm sorry, we forgot to introduce ourselves. My name's Malaya and this is my husband, Kimpoi. It's a pleasure to meet you. They seem nice, they seem really sweet. We're already getting more villagers and more NPCs to remember. We are literally gonna have birthdays every single day of the year. I'm a little bit scared by that. In the comments, it was kind of a mixed bag whether you all liked the mod or didn't. I think I'm gonna keep it for a couple more episodes and see if we get too overwhelmed with the content. Also, with the 2.0 update, it was recommended that you start a new save when you add the mod but I haven't done that so I'm a little bit scared that it's gonna break something <laughs> so we just gotta keep our fingers crossed for that I think oh you're Lil so you're the new farmer who's moved into the valley oh my gosh I'm tired of being told this <laughs> why do they say the exact same thing my sister mentioned you in one of her letters who's your sister you've been really helpful Lil we really appreciate it it's quite embarrassing really forgetting the whereabouts of our own hometown not really all right then I think we better go see you around Lil bye so you're telling me you let go of a place you were washing because you were excited for a phone call from some lottery? Where's Olga just come from? Wait, <laughs> I'm so confused. What's happening? Now tell me, how much did you win? Will it cover the shattered plate? The plate that I told you is my favourite plate. What is happening? <laughs> now, hun, uh... Oh no, poor Bert. Correction, was my favourite plate. Olga, it's all gone, hun. Shattered. All for a measly 20 gold you won over the lottery. And the lottery ticket costed 25 gold. Hun, why? Why is everyone calling each other hun? It feels so weird and fake. <laughs> hey, watch where you... 
Wait, is that the sister? Ollie? Sis? <gasps> hey, what's the hold up? Oh, it's reuniting. What's going on? Hey, Olga, Bert. Do they not recognize them? Smoking horses. You two? You're back? We're sorry we didn't inform you ahead, Ollie. I have so much, so much to tell and scold you about, big brother. Olga is so aggressive. Ollie, why are your lips trembling? Are you okay? Olga hugged Kim boy. <laughs> I miss you, you big oaf. That's kind. <laughs> it's nice seeing you too, Malaya. How are your legs doing? Getting used to those yet? Olga, shush. We're not alone. Hi, <laughs> I'm still here. Like, why haven't I left? I'm so rude. Why would I just stand here and watch this all go down? I would have just left by now, surely. I helped them get here and then they said thank you. And then that's my cue to literally leave. Why am I still here? <laughs> oh no, I didn't see you there. You heard nothing. Yep, definitely. Oh, and I guess you've met them. Yep, I have. This is like the world's longest cutscene, I swear. Lil here guided us to where the cable car was. We sort of forgot the whereabouts. Well, it's been so long. On that topic, it's been so long since your daughter saw you two. <gasps> Alyssa, these are are the parents of Alyssa? Wait, they left her? You both should hurry up and go to her. Wait, I wonder why they left her. I I don't know how to approach her now. Stop sulking and go to her. Olga is so angry. I kind of love it. Oh yes, we have to go. Thank you once again, Lil. It's literally no bother. It was like 20 steps. Let's go meet our daughter. They headed off to Ridgeside Village. Would you like to follow them? No, not really. I do kind of want to see how it plays out, but I don't want the whole episode to be a cutscene. So we'll just stay here. We need to go mine anyway. I bet the Leidens will have a wonderful reunion. I hope they will. Also, to be honest, I didn't want to go because it's also really awkward. <laughs> it's really uncomfortable. Why would I have gone with them? <laughs> literally makes no sense. They literally just met me and I'd be like tagging along for their reunion. Right, let's go and give this melon to Demetrius. I still haven't made up my mind about Ridgeside Village, if I like the mod or not. It's so massive. I think it's really good if you're super bored of the game and you really want something to reignite your excitement with the game. But other than that, it's a massive mod to add. I don't know if it's gonna stay part of this series. I think it's really fun, but I just, I think it might be a little bit too much content to focus on at once so we might be going just to oh i didn't mean to talk to you ian busy too yep yep i am see ya okay i just wanted to get in the door can i just please thanks <laughs> Oh, we've got another cutscene. Okay, this is a normal Stardew cutscene. It's okay. This is the problem. If I'm having like constant cutscenes in an episode, it's really hard to get anything done. Oh, hello there. My dad and I are just testing some soil samples. I remember this one from when I tried to romance Maru. Don't be shy. We could use a hand actually. Could you watch this beaker for me? I'm going to grab the last batch of samples. Basically in this cutscene, Demetrius is an absolute piece of work. For lack of a better term, I'll be right back. Thanks for helping out, Lil. Maru's a good kid. She's my special little girl. The music just stopped. That's so dramatic. Why did that happen? <laughs> oh no. Demetrius just turns around and the music cuts out. I wouldn't want anything getting in the way of her bright future. Know what I mean? I know exactly what you mean. Just some food for thought. <laughs> and the music's back on. <laughs> I guess it was like a, to build the suspense, to build the threat in the air. Hey, sorry about that. I hope you found something to talk about while I was gone. I was just telling Lil about the soil samples we were testing. Sure you are, Demetrius. Right, Lil? The thing is, I have absolutely no intention of befriending Demetrius or Maru, so I'm just gonna say this one. Usually I went for say nothing, so I think I'm gonna go, actually, your dad was being weird. Huh? What did you say to her, dad? Look how angry she is. I haven't seen this one play out, so this is nice. Okay, okay, we were talking about you, sweetie. I wanted to say a few things to Lil about you, but I didn't want to embarrass you. I shouldn't have lied about it. Kind of feel awkward now. <laughs> Why do I put my foot in it? That's okay, dad. I understand. We should get back to work before these samples crystallize. He's definitely not happy at me, is he? Well, he shouldn't have put me in an awkward situation. Anyway, I bought him a melon. Yeah, we've probably lost friendship. It was worth it to see the other option. This is perfect. It's just what I need for my research. It's gonna be hard not to eat it. Thanks a bunch. No worries. What did we get? Okay, we got 550. Nice. Is there anything I was saving for? Was I saving for like a barn or something? We don't have that yet, do we? No, we, we do have a barn. What was I saving for? The barn upgrade, maybe? Or the coop upgrade? Literally don't know. <laughs> okay, let's go mining. It's already half 12 and we haven't even got to the mines yet. This is not great. Okay, let's see how far we can get in the mines today. We're already floor 90. So maybe we can aim to try and get to 100. I don't know if that will happen. 10 floors in a couple hours. Probably quite difficult, but we'll try. It is a good luck day. Oh, ladder already. Ow, nay. <laughs> There's so many. Why is there so many? Aggressive clicking on the mouse. I'm sorry. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna die. Let me eat a cheese. Oh, and a crab. Are you serious? 
Oh, we got a bomb though. Nice. Let's just start trying to get the ladder. Let's get this aquamarine. And we also need a bunch of copper. And there's a diamond. Heck yeah. Okay, we're doing quite good pace. We've just unlocked 95. I don't know if we'll make it all the way though. Whoa, we just got another diamond. Okay, this is a very good luck day. Okay, we're getting close. We're 98. We might be able to make it. There's a purple mushroom. Did we need that? I think we might have needed that. We have the mushroom cave, so we've probably definitely donated a purple mushroom before. I think that's another playthrough. I get so confused with all my different playthroughs going on. I also wanted to try and upgrade my pickaxe again because there's still the top area of the farm that we haven't accessed and i'd really like to do that soon is this the big curvy one? Oh, there's no chance we get oh i was just about to say there's no chance we're getting to 100 but apparently the mines had different choices we've got a star drop is this our first star drop it might be right let's carry on going shall we oh no this is overrun by monsters let's see if we can slay them all get our combat up oh my gosh there's so many oh my gosh we almost died we had three health oh no <laughs> there's just so many of them how am i supposed to fight them all at once i definitely should have just left oh well there's there's no way we're making it down another floor oh we died. Why did I stay? What did we lose? Oh no. You're a lucky girl. You're lucky Jill and I, I read that as you're a lucky girl. <laughs> that had a completely different meaning to the sentence. You're lucky Jill and I were on patrol. We were able to save you down there. These caverns are perilous though. Be vigilant next time. What did we lose? Ow, I seem to have lost. <gasps> we lost five. I No, no, <laughs> not the diamonds and the obsidian edge. How, how did we lose? Two diamonds and the obsidian edge. For what? Oh my gosh, I'm so gutted. <laughs> Don't you only get one item back? I think I'm gonna go for the diamonds. They're worth more. And if I sell them, I can buy something better. I went for the diamonds, but we don't have a sword now. How much is the obsidian edge? Can you even buy it? You can't. Okay, I think I chose the wrong thing. <laughs> How did I mess up that much? Oh, I'm embarrassed. Wait, did I have to buy them back? I thought that was their value. Oh, I'm such an idiot. I'm such an idiot. <laughs> I'm never going mining again. This is awful. At least we made it to floor 100. But then everything else after that was a total mess. So I'm sorry. Hey, it's not Stardew about a little bit of chaos, right? We need to make some serious cash back now. I didn't mean to spend that. I thought that was the value of it. Heck, I should have gone for the obsidian edge, shouldn't I? How much do diamonds even sell for? I need to get a crystallarium. Okay, we're back at the farm. Let's put on these gold bars. This is so tragic. We do have Oh, we have a level one sword. That's all we have. Are we gonna try and do floor 100 plus with a level one sword? I guess that's what we're gonna be doing next time we go mining. At least we're getting some diamonds back, which will probably sell for less than I bought them for. Okay, my farm is an absolute mess. Let's grab the cheese and we can sell that. We need as much money as we can. How did I die on that floor? I should have just left at floor 100. We should place these crab pots somewhere. We do have a little pond on our farm, so we could put them here for now. I think we can get some like snails and such from here. I think most of the time it will probably give us trash though. Did we get an upgrade to our coop already or is that what we're saving for i don't think it's upgraded at all that's probably what we should work on next right let's just head to bed let's write off today as a bad day and head to bed if the cat will let me through the door that is let's just forget today ever happened right oh and we leveled up in combat well isn't that great let's do let's do fighter we're level five combat somehow i don't know how that happened we have 6.7k again that's pretty good and the merchant is also in town oh Got another cutscene. <laughs> it's Kim Poi. Good morning, Lil. Uh, lovely morning, isn't it? Anyway, I came here to tell you that I'll finally be reopening Nightingale Orchard Seed Shop. <gasps> Is there gonna be different new seeds? I'll be selling foreign and exotic fruit trees there, just like what you see planted in our farm. I, uh, hope that you can visit soon, fellow farmer. That's really cool. What plants can we get? What trees? We'll have to go and explore that. I don't think we're gonna have enough money for any of them, but we can see. Let's water all our crops quickly. I think we should go and have an explore of that. We also really need to go and talk to Sophia. We don't have any poppies grown yet for her, but we'll have to see what we can get. Oh, and we got some things from the crab pots. We got a snail. We definitely need a periwinkle, right? Unless we've already done the crab pot yeah we've already done the crab pot <laughs> okay so we don't need any of these but at least we can give them as gifts and um, we also got some broken glasses which we can put in there oh and we got some more batteries nice having those lightning rods early has been really good and we got our diamonds in the mail how much are they gonna sell for i doubt we're gonna make money off of those i think we lost money i made a big error i should have gone for the obsidian edge i don't know why i chose not to also we need more iron we're kind of running very low on iron i want to make enough gold bars to upgrade a tool as well definitely need to upgrade this coop as well oh i forgot the milk pail <laughs> 
Why do I do that every time? Did we already have a large milk? I think we have, right? Oh no, we haven't donated that yet. Okay, we can donate a large milk. That's really good. Is that our first ever large milk? Okay, we're gonna go down to the traveling merchant. What should I take for Sophia? Let's give her our gold quality melon. She deserves it, okay? <laughs> we haven't barely spoken to her in so long. I think I wanna start working on something on my farm. I wanna make a tree farm. Do I have the tree fertilizer recipe yet? I don't think I will. Oh no, I do. Okay, we can make some tree fertilizer as well. Okay, we've got baked fish, we've got poppy seed muffin, midnight cart, anything that we need though. We could get another rare seed. I think that might be a shout, although we are saving our money. So maybe we'll leave that. Yeah, we'll leave that because we can get a seed maker eventually and just use our one rare seed to keep making new seeds. Let's go and see Sophia. We haven't checked in with her for a while and I kind of feel bad because we've just been meeting other people. We have more hearts with Maru and Pam than Sophia. This is a mess. I need to get more hearts with my lady. Where even is she today? Is she in here? Oh no, <laughs> where is she? Okay, I have no idea where Sophia is today. I guess we'll go up to the community center and see if we find her on our way. I'm gonna go via the beach as well so we can forage. We need all the monies we can get. Hi Haley. Haley's looking real cute. Emily usually cooks dinner, but she makes weird stuff like quinoa. <laughs> Who are you? You're new? Carmen! Today should be a good day for fishing. Do you know what? That's actually not a bad idea. I should probably fish today. We do need some serious money. So maybe I should spend today fishing. Let's grab the one forageable that we have on the whole entire beach. Wow. Today has just not gone to plan. Sophia! Sophia! I've got you a melon. You're sweet, thanks. Three hearts now. Wait, we went up. Ugh, I, I'm ruining my eyeliner. Sorry, now isn't a good time. Wait, why? We just went up to three hearts. And we're gonna have poppies tomorrow so we can get on her really good books. Okay, the milk is needed for the animal bundle, right? Here we go. Okay, so we just need two more things. Goat milk and duck egg are probably gonna be the easiest ones to get maybe. Or the wool, I don't know. I don't know, we could get rabbits and get wool, but I think it's, is it? a high drop chance? I don't really know. I think it's probably better to upgrade the coop twice to get the duck and the rabbit rather than trying to go for the barn upgrades because they're super expensive. Let's pop into Robins and see what is the next upgrade cost for the coop and then we'll fish for the rest of the day I think to try and make the money for the coop upgrade. <laughs> Construct farm buildings. Okay coop upgrade. I think we also need another silo at some point too. Okay big coop. 10,000 gold, 400 wood and 150 stone. I feel like that's manageable We'll also unlock the ducks. I'm gonna have to fish a bunch now. Could we make 4,000 gold in one day of fishing? Let's see, shall we? I doubt it's gonna happen, but we can try. It's already 3 p.m., so we'll see how this goes. And we got algae as our first catch. Nice. <laughs> okay, I need to get perfect for every fish. Is that gonna be possible? Okay, that was perfect, and it was a carp, so that's not really an achievement. <laughs> they barely move. Okay, well, we lost our perfect. What fish is this? Is this a sturgeon? No, 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 please keep control, Lil. <gasps> we got a sturgeon? Did we need a sturgeon still? Hang on. <gasps> we got a sturgeon! I got a sturgeon! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy my heart is racing. We got a sturgeon. We can finish this bundle, heck yeah! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. And it's a gold quality sturgeon as well. I am a pro at fishing. <laughs> Definitely not, but still. Ooh, we got two emeralds in a chest. That's pretty good. That's definitely gonna help with the funds. I don't know how much emeralds sell for, but I imagine a lot. <laughs> Hopefully. Okay, I think we are probably gonna head back. We did an okay job at fishing, I feel like, today. We've got the emeralds. We've got quite a few iridium and gold quality. Actually, they're all iridium and gold quality fish. I think we did okay. We're gonna sell all of these. We'll probably quickly run past the community center and donate our sturgeon. I'm so happy about that. Okay, the sturgeon is in and we've completed that bundle. I'm so happy. What did we get? Wow, we got a fishing tackle, great. So we just have catfish, tiger trout, and walleye left to get. And I don't know if we need any of those these seasons, but I should probably have checked when we had rain. Right, let's sell all these fish and the emeralds as well and see how much money we can make. Oh, we also have the jams and we probably have the cheese and mayos ready as well. We want all the monies today. Let's quickly head to bed and see how much money we made. How much did we get from the diamonds as well? <laughs> We literally bought them for the price we sold them. That was not worth it at all. I'm so sad about that. I should have gone for the obsidian edge. I don't know why I thought to go for the diamonds. But we made loads. We definitely have enough for the coop upgrade. It's also raining so we could get the catfish today. We have 13k. This is like the most we've had in forever. We can finally pick our poppies as well to give one to Sophia today. Okay, so we're gonna head down to Sophia, gift her a poppy. Then we're gonna go and upgrade our coop. 
Oh, we should probably do the catfish too, actually. Let me see if they definitely can be got in summer rain. It's not that urgent because they can be got in the summer in the secret woods, but they can also be got in the fall. So if we don't get it, it's okay. The walleye needs to be in the fall in the rain. Okay, we don't, we can't get that yet. And what was the other fish that we had? I think it was tiger trout. And tiger trout also has to be gotten in fall. So I feel like we should just wait with the fishing maybe. We don't need to fish today. Right, let's go and see Sophia. Oh, and I need to bring enough wood and stone for the upgrade, don't I? Do I have enough wood and stone? I've just assumed that I do. Oh no, we don't. <laughs> We don't have enough wood. Didn't we need like 300 wood or something? Let's just quickly work on getting some wood. <laughs> I think I want my tree farm to either go here. I need to scythe all that grass as well. Sorry, I'm working on like 10 different things at once. I need to be a bit clearer because <laughs> y'all are probably like, wait, what tree farm now as well? Did I need 350 wood? I think I did. Hopefully this will be the last tree we need to chop. Okay. We need one more, of course. Okay, we've got all the wood we need. So let's go and see Sophia quickly. There she is. Here's a poppy. For me, thank you so much. We still have only three hearts of her, but hopefully it's going up. One of my favorite anime characters has pink hair. I dyed my hair to match hers and I loved it so much I never changed it. I love your pink hair. Hey, did you know that Abigail never has to dye her hair? Wait, it's naturally purple. I know, right? Strange. <gasps> is this feeding into the conspiracy of the wizard being Abby's dad? I believe that conspiracy. <laughs> We've had so much rain this episode. Like, what are the chances? It's summer. Why do we keep having storms? I mean, it's kind of nice, but also there's a limit, right? There's a limit to how much rain you want to have in an episode. Two hours or three of the days have been rain. Oh, there's something on the board here. I need a gold bar. <gasps> we can accept that. I don't know who Philip is. Is it a timed one? Oh, it is. Two days. We might be able to get that over to Philip. I don't know who Philip is though. <laughs> Let's get this coop upgrade finally. And then I think next episode we should be able to upgrade our pickaxe for sure. We have the gold bars, we just don't have enough money. Okay, big coop. Wait, it's 400 wood. Oh no, quick, we need to get more wood. Robin's so expensive, I swear. Right, this should be the last tree we need, I hope, if I've calculated right. Okay, we have 400. I'm so excited. We're finally gonna be able to get ducks and be a step closer to complete in that bundle. <laughs> Right, let's go and clear our farm. Although, should we go and do the delivery request first? Maybe we should. We need to find who Philip is. And I still need to talk to Lola to get the money for that. So we need one gold bar. For Lola, we just need to go and talk to her. So I need to find her. Have we even met Philip yet? Philip. Okay, yeah, we do know who Philip is. I'm so glad the cable car doesn't cost money. Oh, it looks so cute in the rain. Oh, who are you? You're new. Oh no, he is the one who owns the shop, right? I can hear your stomach growling from here. What can I get you? I mean, you're not at your shop. <gasps> Wait, let me just clear these a little bit. It. These shouldn't be here. But this is new. This wasn't here last time. Kenneth's robot. Wait, Kenneth's moved house? Kenneth didn't live here before. Good day, Lil. I've been pretty busy today. What about you? Kenneth's house used to be in town and that was abandoned last time. I'm so confused. Has that changed since the update? This has changed too. This used to be a stables. Oh no. <laughs> Don't look at the grass on the house. Just ignore this. I can't even get to it. Whose house is this? Anton. Oh, hey, I hope you're having a good day. Is this Anton's house? Oh, is this a hospital? Okay, a lot has changed because this was where Kenneth lived, I think. <gasps> Who are you? They're so cute. Oh my gosh, why are they so cute? <laughs> I'd really love a nap, but I saw some pretty birds today and I've got a new idea. They look so sweet. Whose house is this? Oh, this house is nice. Oh, it's like an Emily. <gasps> this is Faye's house. Faye is an Emily, but cuter. What has she got here? <gasps> you can buy things from her. Oh, she's a cutie. Oh, there's also a truck here. Yeah, things are like kind of overlapping because there's something buried under these trees. I think this is why you needed to have a new save. The map has changed so much and I've only visited once, so I'm very overwhelmed. I didn't want to spend all day here, but I literally can't find Lola at all. There's a tree in someone's house. This is not great. <gasps> this is a shop. Whose shop is this? Sorry, we're closed. Oh no, because if I look on the map, I can't actually, oh. It's updated so I can see now. I could have seen this whole time. Lola and Freddy, okay, they're way over there. Who's that? Is that Lola? <gasps> Yay, this is Lola's house. Hello dear, how does your week look? Okay, we got the money for that at least. I really wanted to get my tree farm done today. <laughs> I don't see that happening now, it's so late. This is the problem with this mod. I feel like I wish there was a slightly smaller version because it's really, really cool that it adds so much to the game, but it's slightly overwhelming. When you already have expanded, there's a lot of content added. I'm not sure how I feel. Like I really love the mod and I kind of want to keep it, but I just think it's slightly too much content. I don't know where Philip is. I'll have to check. He's probably gone home by now. He sleeps at like 
9 p.m. so we definitely wouldn't have had a chance of getting him. So I guess we'll just work on our tree farm instead. Okay, so this area I wanted to have as my tree farm. I want to have some rows of trees along here. For that I need to clear all this grass, but we can barely see anything so that kind of sucks. And we'll do a couple rows. So I think each will have like two rows of three maybe. I think six trees would definitely be enough. Really dark though, I can barely see anything. Okay, so let's put like the acorn down. Oh, we could probably fit four. Let me get more seeds. I'm doing this so haphazardly, I'm sorry. It's also so late, so I feel like I won't be able to finish this in time. Oh, we also have mahogany seeds. I guess I should put some of those down too. And then we'll do like two rows of each of these. It's 1 a.m. I'm running out of time. I haven't got fertilizer on these yet either. And then we'll put the pine cones and then we will sleep. We've started our tree farm. At least we can say we did it because I really didn't think we were going to have time in this episode. Am I going to make it to bed? That is the question. Run, Lil! Let's see how our tree farm looks. Did I place them all right even though it was dark? I think I did. Okay, this is going to be a pretty good tree farm, I think. I'm actually very excited. And then I think we could fit some mahoganys around here. And then we'll put tappers on these and we'll put signs up and it will look really cute in the future. I think Robin will be working on our coop now. She is. She's working on the coop already. Look at her go. We love to see it. But yeah, I think I'm going to wrap up there. Thank you all so much for watching this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Again, let me know what you think of the mod. I'm so conflicted because I really do love the content it's adding. It's just a lot and it's a bit intense maybe with what we're already trying to achieve in the game. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you in the next one. Bye everyone!